They did what? When? How? Are you sure? <sighs> Y'all have a good night. And to all. <laughs> Why off? Everybody calling my phone, blowing me up. What the f***? What happened? What's going on? I'm going back to bed. Good night. Oh man, so social media is reacting to the Drake diss using AI, you know, getting the help from Tupac and Snoop Dogg to encourage Kendrick to hurry up and drop his diss. Now, it's not going over too well with the masses. Some people are enjoying the creativity, but as far as the idea of using AI and also some of the bars and trying to lessen the blow, trying to take away angles from Kendrick, people not really feeling it. But y'all heard Snoop at the beginning of the video, he didn't really say too much, just um reacted to everyone blow up his phone. But let's get to some more reactions though. So they're saying nigga use Tupac voice and they ain't even say enemies and Hennessy. <laughs> Shaking my head. J Roth and TDE post this right here. Nobody trying to hear that bullshit, oh. man. Crooked Eye says the AI shit ain't it. Push ups is way better, but like that is still in the lead in my opinion. Good Saturday to you. Van Lathan says Drake's record is objectively weird, cringy, and corny. Reason for TDE reposted this person with his Jada <laughs> Pinkett Smith meme telling Drake to do the voice. This is crazy. You sick, man. Deezy says, Pusha said you're hiding a kid. AI said you're grooming them kids. Now, Ice from the Joe Bunner podcast chimes in saying the dope shit and all this is realizing that Pot listens to the pod. One of your Patroni too. Imani said Drake playing the new age games while still showing he's down to compete and gotta respect it. Carlos Miller says, AI rap ain't some shit I want to ever hear again in life unless it's a parody or some shit like that. Damian Woody says that AI diss track by Drake is whack. I'm sorry. DJ Flash says, just heard Drake's telling me freestyle. He should have kept that one in his hard drive. Now some reaction for some random folks. This person right here says, this nigga did audio blackface. That's crazy. This YouTuber said, Drake, you put a full strike on my channel for covering that old AI song that went viral. Team Kendrick all day. And that's funny because this dude from, um, Audio Mac says this right here. UMG has been issuing DMCA takedown notices for the past year whenever an AI fake Drake songs pop up. Now I need to find out how they feel about the second biggest act in their label system using AI. A major endorsement to do the same thing. Great point. Great point. Dude said niggas send a cease and assist to French and then use AI to make a Snoop and Tupac song. And y'all applauding it? Yeah, y'all right. I'm going to bed. They say we celebrating AI pocket Snoop versus now. Call me when y'all ready to be serious. This person says Kendrick Lamar super fans can't really complain about AI because more than man was him and Tupac having a convo. The hard part five, Kendrick changed his face to different people and speaking in Nipsey's perspective, Drake is trolling. In other words, when he does it, it's art, but when Drake does it, it's weird. It proves how you really feel about Kendrick's antics. He low key having a meltdown over the silence. Talk about him liking young girls. Heard it on the Budding podcast. Must be true. Nah, I can't spend that away. We got the footage. The eight mile I am white trash strategy not saving you when it comes to history with underage women. No way to well actually yourself out of that one. There's videos, pal. That man used Tupac voice to say, hey, talk about how he likes young girls and y'all killing chestnut checkers. Nah, man, this ain't it at all. I'm tapping out on this round. I'll be back when Ross calls that dude Timothy Chamelet, <laughs> Chamelet or some shit. They say, you know, Ross can't say Chalamet like a regular person, nigga. If I'm a regular person, I can't even say Chalamet. I don't know what the name is. I don't know what to do this. Oh, that's this dude? Okay, whatever. Drake talking about you never got locked up, shot nobody. He didn't either. Nah, Drake cooked Kendrick with that Telemay freestyle on God. And they quoted that, you know, with the um, nerd boy meme from that movie, Polar Express. Nigga admitted to liking young girls in the diss. <laughs> Drake just casually admitted he likes young girls and his fans saying he's brilliant. <laughs> That was easily the lamest diss track I've ever heard. That makes Ghoulish by Wayne sound good. Little Silence has Aubrey showing y'all his cards. Kendrick is playing the rap game. Drake is playing the internet game. Like I told y'all last video. 
Drake literally is using the B Rabbit Pro saying things Kendra might say on a diss track before he gets a chance. Softening the punches, this isn't looking good at all. Your ops formed the allegiance against you and you're clapping back with AI features. You couldn't phone a friend. Drake is one of the biggest artists on the planet. Fact, people who criticize Drake aren't all haters though. He does whack shit fairly regularly. He got hits, doesn't mean he's immune to whackness. Jay-Z is my goat and he dropped Kingdom Come with a straight face. Whack is whack. Nigga got pop rapping all beat, it's truly blasphemy. Did he forget that it took him three weeks to respond with the leak and a whole month to officially release this response? Drake definitely cut with push-ups. That response is great, but he's out here acting like he replied back to him in less than a day. Nigga used AI for Snoop. Snoop alive. Why you ain't put the money in his pocket? Cause Snoop fuck with Doc. It really is corny, but I know y'all love that boy. Snoop at home probably like, what the fuck did I say this? <laughs> okay, so someone posted this article with a rapper who admitted that he was the person behind the Kendra Lamar AI and dude says wow now i see why drake team reached out to the guy who did the ai kendra disc they made him walk through the process and he thought it was to prove it was really him whole time they were taking notes for this diabolical rory from the rory and mall podcast says i apologize to cole says to make things clear i thought drake was drake move was genius and i'm still here for the mess kendra can stand on the clock i'm just putting together the pieces in my head and wanted to apologize to cole and look well this might go left do y'all think j cole owes is owed an apology based on how things are going so far all right 19 keys man he really reiterates my point from when i first reacted to the drake diss he says drake dropped the diss strategically using ai pocket snoop then finishing off the freestyle himself this is monumental for an artist of size to use ai at the rumors of the fake ai diss it was innovative and strategic not only to take all the air out of kendrick's diss but to also control the narrative and be on the offensive now kendrick has to take the bait and respond soon to win or he risks drake dropping another track in between i love the strategy and that's what come down to me like i told you before it's not a great diss but it's interesting the, um the angle they took when it came to doing it and his strategy behind it hey man but y'all gotta let me know what y'all gotta say in the comment section below they tearing drake up i seen y'all y'all pretty much going hard in the last video as well in the comment section but let me know what y'all think i'm gonna go ahead and get up out of here though this is another update with stace